So these are the ingredients you need for this recipe. So firstly, you'd want to crush 30 of the Oreos you have, and not all of them. And if you don't have a food processor, you could use a rolling pin and put your Oreos in a Ziploc bag. But I use a food processor because it was so much easier and so much quicker to get them in fine crumbs. And then you'd want to combine your Oreo crumbs with half of your butter. Since you have one cup, you'd want to use half of it and not all of it. And this part is quite tricky, you just want to like mix the butter into the Oreo and I actually ended up using my hands because it was a lot easier to combine than just using a spoon. Then you'd want to line your baking pan with some parchment paper so it'd be easier for you to get out your Oreo bars later on. And pour in your Oreo mixture into the pan and start pressing it against the side. And make sure it's all even and not uneven. <laughs> and then you'd want to chill the crust until it's firm. So for the filling in a medium mixing bowl, you'd want to combine the powdered sugar, half cup of softened butter, milk, and vanilla in a bowl. And then you'd want to mix that on medium high speed for two to three minutes or until everything is well combined and the filling is nice and smooth and creamy. So here you'd want to add in the remaining of your 10 Oreos and just mix that into your mixture. And once your crust is chilled and firm, you'd want to take that out of the fridge and spread your mixture over the top of the crust. And make sure you spread them evenly all over the crust so there are no uneven bits. And here I just spreaded some remaining Oreos at the top and leaving some larger bits to put around. And you'd want to refrigerate this for 30 minutes or until it is ready to serve. So now that it's ready, I just used a knife and cut these into four. And then I just cut them into fours again on so that they're all even and these were honestly super super good and super tumbler to photograph as well <laughs> if you're interested in that. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video as it's a perfect dessert for the summertime. And remember to subscribe and give this video a like if you enjoyed it and I'll see you very soon. Bye! Bye.